Well, we know that hand sanitizer has been very hard to find, and we know that sanitizer contains alcohol. On your side, Jeff Fallon is in St. Augustine tonight, where the distillery is pitching in to help police and the public. Well, hello there. When St. Augustine Distillery makes, say, bourbon or gin or vodka, there's always a little bit of excess alcohol at the top of the stills called the heads. Much too strong to drink, but a perfect strength to help fight the spread of coronavirus. That is, is high proof and you'll, you'll smell it. St. Augustine Distillery is joining in the spirit of sanitization these days. We're going to go like that, Jeff, and just rub your hands. One of the number one ingredients is ethanol, which is alcohol, which is what we make here every day. And we said, hey, how, how can we help? Just days ago, CEO Philip McDaniel and company went to work using a potent alcohol byproduct called Heads from liquor production to create hand sanitizer, cleverly called Heads Up delivering the first 200 bottles to St. Augustine Police Chief Barry Fox for officers to use in their patrol cars. He said, Philip, we cannot find hand sanitizer. And I was like, Chief, what do you need? Of course. Not stopping there, the distillery will soon make the two ounce bottles available for free at its gift shop on Riberia Street, suggesting donations to help another worthy local cause. We've partnered uh, with the American Legion uh, in West Augustine, they're building a new kids safe zone playground that is really exciting. We're going to have the battleship, the connect for uh, the monkey bars, the swings, wiffle ball field. The project at Post 194 to include a pavilion for all ages will cost $100,000 and they're only about a third of the way to their goal. Not only does it help the veterans, but it also helps the kids. So we get it both ways at this point in time. Distilling at least a slightly better situation from the coronavirus crisis. It's all about the karma, right? You're going to put it out there and hopefully it'll, it'll get in the right hands. No pun intended. So you can get a bottle of this anytime. Bottles of the Heads Up will be available starting this Friday. For more information, check out this story at firstcoastnews.com. At St. Augustine Distillery, Jeff Ballin, First Coast News, on your side.